Hello you guys, this is Candy back again with another video. I had a lot of people to ask me what kind of foods you can eat that you can grow at home for natural hair and um, for hair growth or whatever. So before I start this video off, I want you all to please like, subscribe, and also make sure you hit the notification bell to make sure you get notified first of when I post a video. Okay, number one, bone broth. That helps with long hair follicles, okay? I'm pretty sure you all know what hair follicles is, so I'm not going to get deep in that. Number two, sea kelp. That's needed to produce the healthy the skin cells, the nails, bones, and the arteries. Then you got number three, you got eggs. That's rich in vitamin um, B7. Biotin helps, you know, that carries the nutrients. Number four is kale. That blocks the production of the DHT due to the um, fire nutrients and the um, butter nutrients. Then you got blueberries, which is high in vitamin C and it's a potent antioxidant. And I think with that, it helps the body grow keratin um, in the form of protein um, that the body is made of. Then you got um, diatomaceous earth. If I pronounced that right, I hope so. If not, then y'all know what I'm talking about. Then you got... Um, Wait a minute, the diatomaceous earth, that is like one of the world's best sort of um, silica, which is vital to maintain strong hair growth when aging, and it also makes the nails shiny and healthy also. Then you have salmon, which everybody knows that's rich in omega-3 um, fatty acids, and it can lower the inflammation in the body. And it also leads to um, stronger hair growth, and it makes the follicles less likely to break. If you like pink cans, that's number eight. That helps with thyroids. And I also seen a Facebook friend that was concerned with their thyroid. So you can um, do pecans, and it's loaded with iodine, and also support with the thyroid, the thyroid glands, and uh, hair growth. You got nine, which is lemon juice. That citric acid, you know, that cleans the body of all the toxins. Then I'm not sure if y'all do flax seeds, but flax seeds supplies the body with vitamin E, selenium, zinc, and that helps with the production of keratin in the hair follicles. Everybody knows number 11, apple cider vinegar. It speeds up the process of the hair growth. Two teaspoons in a glass of water with a nutritious food such as salmon trout or mackerel you know fish that's good then you also have salmon that blocks dht from your hair all right you guys um i just said salmon helps block the dht no i take that back number 12 is spinach it blocks the dht from your hair and it contains zinc iron and many um traces of minerals for your hair then we got 13, which is sweet peppers, which is um, good with vitamin C. And it pr promotes um, collagen production and presents free radicals from damaging the body once you age. And then it also contains vitamin A to stimulate the healthy oils in the scalp that protect the hair from damage. Number 14 is going to be shrimp. Everybody loves shrimp. That grows out the hair in extraordinary amounts of vitamin D and protein is within shrimp. You also have um, zinc and iron, and that's good for strong hair growth and longevity. Okay, then you got number 15, which is my number one favorite, is oysters. You can reverse some of the types of hair loss with oysters. Number 16 is avocados. That's a great source of nutrition for almost all bodily problems. It has a high amount of vitamin E, which um, stimulates stronger hair growth in a couple of months. And it also protects the help, the um, hair and the scalp from irritation. And it also contains essential fatty acids, which um, form the building blocks of the cells in the body and promote healthier, stronger hair. These foods also provide everything the body needs to get on track with the growing healthy follicles in the skin cells, the nails, and the collagen. Also, I want to let you all know that the extra, extra virgin olive oil, coconut oil helps... Um, with the scalp, if you massage it often, and it keeps the fungus, the bacteria at bay, and conditions the hair naturally. I want you all to try some of these um, foods and see how it works. If it does, give me a like. It's only free. 
So give me a like, subscribe, and share with all your friends. Thank you. Peace.